Hello and welcome friends. Today we will understand like how GitHub webhook work. So let me go through a previous scenario which we have used in our one of the previous project. So you can see like once the developer is pushing all the code to the GitHub repository, Jenkins start Jenkins automatically starts git checkout. So how this happen? So there we have to set webhook. Okay. So webhook, once we will set webhook between GitHub and uh, this Jenkins server, so Jenkins through API request, Jenkins will automatically come to know like something new uh, commit has came to the Git repository. So once Jenkins will know, it will automatically uh, trigger the job instead of a manual trigger. Okay, so let's see how to do it. So for that, first you have to first you have to see like right now for the one of the our third devops project we are running the previous sign website still right so what we want how to configure github poll uh, this github webhooks so you first thing you have to do like you have to go to the project then you have to go to the settings just click on the settings and in the left side you can see so this one repository make sure you are using for your project so inside this go to the settings click on webhooks so see i have already one running so let me delete this and i will create one more here so just click on add webhook and here you have to provide the payload url so you want to notify jenkins right so just copy the URL of Jenkins from here. This is the URL which you have to copy. Just go to your add webhook here. And here you have to write this extra lines github hyphen webhook webhook. And make sure you have uh, given this last extra symbol here, right? Okay, so once you have done this. After that, you have to choose one of the content type. You can choose anything as per your requirement. So I'm going with this application JSON. So here you have to provide the secret. So you have provided the payload URL. Now you have to provide the secret. So from Jenkins server, you have to uh, provide this secret. Just go to Jenkins server. Just click on your username. Just click on configure. Once you will click on configure so you can see I have already generated one token let me delete that so this is a new fresh API token you can see here just click on add token and you can click on generate token so that you will get one token here so this token you have to pass it to your uh, here in the, the secret so let me do that so I have copy pasted so here you can select uh, any of the trigger webhook event so just the push event send me everything let me select individuals I am going with this just the push event so once you will do that once you have provided the secret make sure there is no spaces left here so just click on add webhook just wait for a second so see it's done once you will get this tick option next thing what you have to do to make use of this webhook you have to just go to your jenkins project project so let me go to the project so once you are on on your jenkins dashboard what you have to do you have to go for any of the project which you have configured like in this project only i have configured so just click on this project just click on configure and here you can see while i will Let's wait for a moment and once it loads you can see I am using the DevOps third project of the git here only correct DevOps third project I have used this project URL to this Jenkins job right so once this is done what you have to take care here you have to check this option see github hook trigger for gitm git scm polling so once you will do that just apply save okay so in which build we are we are in 11 so i am not going to touch this time i am not going to build this uh, manually this job manually so what i am i will do i will just go to my code editor 
so let me show you the website is running here this is now sign website running here so I will just make changes to my code so let me uncomment this and let me comment this so once you will do the needful changes what I am going to commit this to the git let me stage it let me name it a unique so once you have done you can see 90 insertion is pending 19 lines so okay after that just push to the origin so once you have pushed just let me go to the Jenkins dashboard once again okay so here we are so let's see okay so see 12th job started running here okay so it should deploy the next website right just wait for a moment until it's complete so it succeeds so let's go to this website and let's reload this okay so this is a way you can configure github webhook so that you you can decrease the manual intervention instead of that you can it will automatically build the code based on your latest commit okay so thanks for watching